So you're trying to add filters to your microphone, whether it's a cheap $10 microphone or maybe it's a $400 microphone going into your OBS studio. My name is Murray. I do a lot of technical videos when it comes to streaming and how to you know, make better content for your viewers. So stick around if that's something you're interested in. I also do have a full in-depth video on how to use OBS Studio, set it up from start to finish. If you're a beginner or a professional, you're gonna learn something from that. Link is in the top right in the cards if that's something you're interested in. But let's take a look and see how you can download VSTs for OBS Studio. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do when installing the VST file onto your computer for OBS Studio is to make sure you have OBS Studio closed so that when you start it up, you don't have any issues with it. Then when you're going to your VST you know, location, I'm gonna do TDR Nova, for example. I'm gonna download their setup and go ahead and run the installation. Go ahead and choose your destination file, but it'll automatically choose the default one, which is totally fine. Then go ahead and click next. And you know, you'll have to do that quite a few times because it's gonna be installing different versions of it so that whatever laptop or desktop you're using, it'll be compatible with it. Once you're good to go, then go ahead and launch OBS Studio. Go ahead to your audio channel, whichever one you desire, go to the settings and click filters. Then you can click the plus button and click the VST option. And then you can choose whatever VST you installed. There you go, hope that helped. If you enjoyed, subscribe, stick around for the future. I do a lot of this helpful resources. And if you wanna learn more about how to add VSTs to your audio, whether it's in OBS Studio or in Streamlabs, or maybe even the Wavelink software from Elgato, I do have videos in the top right in the cards on how to do all of that. Now, chances are that when you're watching this, you're a content creator of some kind, and Visuals by Impulse is a really great resource. They're not sponsoring the channel, but they do support it through the affiliate links that I have. And if you use the link down below, you get 5% off your order and you get amazing stream assets such as overlays, alerts, or other emotes for your Twitch channel, YouTube channel, whatever you use for your streaming platform, you can just make it better for your viewers. And ultimately your viewers are gonna really enjoy it and it's gonna increase growth for your stream. So feel free to check those out. They've got a lot of free options too, which I use some of the free stuff as well on my stream. And if you enjoyed the video, you made it this far, please leave a like, that'd be appreciated. I'll see you next time, but until then, make something great. Oh, and click this video because it's about how to set up OBS Studio from start to finish. I had a lot of fun with it. It's literally A to Z on everything you need to know about OBS Studio. The viewers really enjoyed it, and I'm sure you will too.